Hi there, I'm Louis from TurboCAD Africa. Today I'm going to show you how to use symbols in your library palette. First off, we need to open the library palette. I'm going to go to Tools, Palettes, and then Library. It will open up your library palette on the right hand side. If you click here on that drop down, um, I'm working on TurboCAD Professional 2018, Professional Platinum. You'll see there's a, a whole bunch of symbols that's available to you there. Um, you, for instance, have parametric furniture, you've got some 3D solid symbols, you've got some different um, standard symbols here ISO, US, British. What we're going to look at now is some landscaping symbols. I'm particularly looking for a tree. I'm going to go into 3D solid symbols and just go down to landscape there we go so here we've got a, a bunch of different uh, symbols you can use for landscaping i'm gonna, just going to go down here and there we go there's a maple tree i'm simply going to click on it hold in my left mouse key and drag it into my drawing right so now standing there next to my house it's not exactly where i want it to be let me turn this house around a bit right um, I'm just going to put it a bit to the front, right, and have it standing there. Okay, so there we go. Now, if I want to change the color of this tree, now if I render it, it's just going to be a dark color. I want to make it green. There's two ways of going about it, but either way, you need to explode your symbol first if you want to edit it. So I'm going to select the tree, going to go to modify and explode. Now first, the easiest way I could do if I just want to make it green, I simply need to go change the light color to a color I want to make it. Alright, and if I now go and render this, it will be a green color. Right, the other option is to change the material properties on this to a certain material. We're not going to do that for the tree. Right, so uh, another symbol I'd like to add in here is, um, is to put a car. Now I've downloaded a car from, from the internet and I'm quickly going to open that. So I'm going to open the drawing of the car that I've downloaded, which is, a, a, I think it's a step file. First I need to navigate to where I've saved it. I've just downloaded it, so it's probably going to lie in my downloads folder. Right? You don't see it right now, that's because the types of file TurboCAD is searching for is a TCW file. I'm just going to change this to all files. Right? And there we go, T6 step. Let's take that and open. Right, here's the car. Download it. Let's have a look. Okay, we just want to rotate this. Well, let's first just copy it over to, to the same drawing we've got the house in. So I'm going to select it. Right click. I'm going to go copy over there. Or you can use Control C on your keyboard. Right, so now I'm going to go over to um, the house drawing I've done, where I've put the tree in, and I'm going to paste the car here. There we go. Now let's rotate this car. I'm just going to tap, and I'm going to put in 90 degrees, and then I would also like to rotate it in this direction. I'm just going to hold shift, and there we go. And there's the car next to the house next to the tree and let's render us. There we go. That's very nice. Alright, um, thank you for watching my video. If you would like to purchase any of our software, download a free trial, have any questions or want to enroll for any training courses, please go to www.turbocad.co.za. Thank you. Bye.